Hello and welcome to Pal World. This is day seven. We are finishing up the first week in Pal World. This is what our base currently looks like after one week, like in game week of playing. Seven game days. We're quite advanced. You get quite far. We are level, I think, 11, almost 12 now. So you can progress fairly fast with this. Fairly, fairly fast. Let's bake some mushrooms. Let's get the ingots put away. Uh, oh, I forgot. I do want him to start making. Oh, I've got it in my inventory. Do, 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 do. No, I don't. What am I doing? So in the last video, we unlocked a bunch of fast travel points. Caught a few extra pals. And we did most of the tools tutorial missions. Now, we're going to save that last one for when we're probably, say, I want to say, like, level 20. Because, man, I don't want to get stuck in a boss fight like I always do. Build a hot spring. Oh, jeez. Where is the hot spring? Here it is. Pal fluids. Stone. Okay. It's relatively easy. You can do that while I'm gone. And let's go... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Thank God you craft two at a time for the nails. Like, they take so long, even with a pal helping you. All right, halfway there, halfway there. I just want to craft a bow. I crafted like a crap ton of arrows, but no bow. There we go, all done. And what do I need for a bow? I need more stone. That's easy. Let's go over here, get some stone. I don't care you're hungry, just wait. Okay, here we are. I just needed five, but let's like stock up since we have like none. Fine, I'll eat while you're healing or stamina. You guys could use some food. There we go. Everyone's stocked up. That should be more than enough stone. It's like 50 or some shit. I'm getting this. <gasps> Wait a minute. I totally forgot, you guys. Okay. I don't think I did this in any of the days that I've played so far, so... Down below my base, below the first checkpoint, there's a chest. And right there is another note, like a castaways journal, and I haven't gone through it yet, ever. So I've been kind of waiting to see if I've picked up all of them or something like that. However, I think you guys deserve, after one week of playing, to see all of those. So give me a second here. Good. And let's see if it's even in... I don't even think it's around here. No, I don't know what, what that's about. You don't get to read it, you just pick it up. I don't know what that's about. Sorry. It's a waste of time. Okay, so they got a berry plantation going, but it doesn't even seem like they're... Oh, yeah. Wait, why is the water guy not watering it? They're not... They're just gonna starve because they're stupid lazy. All right, so we're gonna grow some berries. Again, they didn't even water it, like, lazy. Lazy pals, I got a water guy for a reason, you know? I got a seeding guy and a watering guy. Excuse me, I didn't mean to uh, yawn so hard. Okay, 
perfect. They're gonna grow some berries now. Wow. This tree is my favorite. It just it just always spawns there. It's like free wood just like that. Just instant. I don't remember what I was doing, even, honestly. We we have to get more pal fluids. Um They do need a bed. I need one more bed. Are you gonna do it yourselves or are you just gonna be lazy? You, what are you doing? You get to work. Do something. Fucking sit there all day, stupid penguin. How are the ingots coming along? Good, Sparky. I don't know what his name is. I forgot. It's like Firefox or something like that. Some cheesy name. So now that we got a bunch of gold coins, like I said, I know I'm on casual mode and I can't lose my inventory. But it's a good practice to get into if you want to play the other version, like the just normal mode. So make sure to put all of your like valuable inventory away. And just make sure, just make sure. That way you don't lose it and you save weight. Like if you put away all the heavy stuff, you can go out there and see. Now I can collect like 300 more wood and, and stuff like that. Like you can really do quite a bit more if you make sure your inventory on your person is clear. So I don't think we're going to get to level 12 today. I think that's going to be in the games next week. We're going to get to level 12, but we'll see here. I need more PAL liquids, PAL fluids. So the only way to do that is to go find more of those guys. Why? Why are yeah. you stupid? Go do work. Why stand there? Work. Yes, switch to automatic work mode. And it's going to come back there. You guys just watch. We'll get back and he'll just be sitting there going, la 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 la. Hmm, let's go to the fort runes. We haven't been there in a little bit. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so the direction I'm facing actually might have a path we could go up to this uh, other island over here. That would be really cool. I have never actually explored that area, so I'm kind of excited. Do I have pal spheres? I do. Good, good, good. Huh. You, attack him. I want to capture it. I don't think it's going to capture. Just wait. It's going to be rough. Oh, I got it. I caught it. Yeah. How about this guy? I don't want my chicken attacking it yet. It's got too little health. Nice, we unlocked T-Fang. There you go, guys. And another castaways journal, more pet flu pal fluids. We need some more though. Hopefully there's a couple more of those guys around here. Which way do I need to go? I wanna go this way. Up the island and to the next one. Do you know how cool it is? I've never actually been this far ever, even on my own account and I'm like level 22 on my account. So, this is pretty dope. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Hello. I know you didn't ask for this, but you're mine. Just gotta travel around them so they don't really stay attacking you. They don't, like, hit you. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's the dodge button. So, B on Xbox is dodge. Yay! And those things are so cool. I'm catching one. I'm catching one. Come here. Come here. It's mine. What is it? What is it? I can't really read. It's a celery. Yeah, we got a celery. That's the one if you, buy, if you do the attachment. We did get to level 12, guys. I didn't think so. We were at such a shitty level, pardon my language, but it would have been so hard to level up from that. I don't know how it happened. Okay, let's get another one of you. More pal fluids, the better. He's caught. I'm not worried. So yeah, um, sorry. As I was saying, Celery actually is the one that you could get an equipment for to, to fly with. That's really cool. And then you just fly around. 
So my goal here is to unlock the fast travel icon to always be able to come here whenever I want. What the? Oh, lamb ball. And these guys are really cute, but they're dangerous. Let's catch one just to show you. Oh. Nice. Instant catch. So that's a crevice. I think we've just discovered like 10 or 12 new pals in the last like, I don't know, two episodes. That to me is insane. But I think we almost have enough power fluids to go do what we were supposed to do. I think we actually do have enough. So let's just unlock fast travel here. Yay. Okay. Now. On the map, it shows that we actually are really close to these two big islands. Those ones, I suspect, are going to have crazy stuff going on. So let's go back to the base and do that last... There we go. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to do it this way. I'm showing you the other way. There we go. Now, because... Well, because we're so close to the levels we are on this, I'm not going to build a new base. I'm just going to make the same mistake I did on my other account, and we're just going to have this one as our kind of normal base. And if I need to later on, we will delete it. And there we go, we can now level up our base. So we're already on the path we need to. We need to unlock the medieval medicine workbench. And down here, there it is. Just leveled up enough. Ah, let's build a saddle for the deer guy. That'll be smart and some better armor. Better armor always is a smart option. And I just personally like to go through and complete it as I go. Like I said before, I'm just grabbing all the things I know I'm going to need here. So now, as you can see, I just need a little bit more leather. And then we can get a saddle and ride the Elkthir... Whatever the... However the hell you say that name. Elkthir or something like that. do 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 Okay, I got a few more, that's good. Everything's up to date. So, ingots. You, sir, have ingots? I can do one more. And I'm gonna need another bed for the next guy. And I think we're gonna put in this guy. Because I can now finally have a logging site done up and he can log for me. So let's get that going. We need wood and stone still. I don't know how much wood. I'm just going to fill up my inventories. Or destroy a whole tree. One of the two. I didn't mute that. That should be enough stone and wood to do what we're trying to do here. I'm going to put the logging site over here. And there, we have this guy mining wood for us on a constant basis. It's perfect. I should actually set up a stone pit because we have the cats and they'll mine wood too, or uh, stone. 
but I do need a bow. So what do I need to craft a bow? Oh no, oh no, auto run. I don't like that. I just need more wood for a bow. Let that stamina recharge. And just axe it. Just axe it. Sorry, Shadow. Sorry, my cat is all up on me. 42 wood. That should be more than enough to craft a bow and some extra arrows. In my opinion, any projectile device, bow and arrow, crossbow, gun, is ideal for capturing pals because you get to keep the distance. And if you deploy a pal, they generally actually go overboard and just kill the one you're trying to catch. And then it's useless, you know. So now we have a bow. Let's equip that to our... It's already equipped. Good. Where is everything stored in this? So there's two free spots for PAL fluids and... I honestly don't know what else I put in there. Huh. I guess ingots? Speaking of, it seems like we're going to need more. I don't know why I did that. The high quality workbench. I just need six more wood. That's easy. He's probably already done that for me here. Just smashing his head against the tree. Aw, oh, damn. I gotta do it with him. Four. Oh, I gotta keep just grabbing it as we go because they keep stealing it from me. Okay, I think that should be enough wood. What was I building anyways? Oh yeah, the high quality workbench. This is the best thing on this game. And as you can see, I haven't really built too much to it. Because like I said, I do want to move the base. And I might do that uh, between the next episode. Because this is an okay location. But it is the starter location. And there's not much around here to discover, to deal with, or anything like that, so I might just take some time off camera and start developing a new base. As long as I can get, I don't know, this, I, I would be scared if I deleted the Poke, or like the PAL base, this thing here, the workbench menu, I would be scared if I deleted that and then it just restarted it and looked like it's level zero, that would be horrible. Like, I would feel so horrible if that happened. Anyways, we only need 30 more wood, and then we can do finish that task. And be done with the PAL workbench freaking tasks for today. Because we've already hit, like, 20 minutes dealing with this, and we have barely had anything cool go on today. It's 20... How am I getting more wood than before? It was 22 wood per tree. That makes no sense. I'm not gonna complain, that's fine, that's fine, I'm happy. More wood, the better. Okay, let's go up here. Take back my chickpea, I don't need him out. Pick that up. Pick that up. Oh, I also need, uh... Oh, I know what I'm doing, I know what I'm doing now. Need the medieval medicine workbench. I'm trying to get ahead of myself here because I see the sun setting. So I'm trying to craft a few things to show you how well they work. Oh god. Oh god. This is just a mess of benches. Sure. That works just as well. So here we have the ability to craft medicine. That takes a long time. I'm not going to bother showing you right now. I want more ingots. That's what I want to show you. 
is what happens when I can get better equipment. Wow. Just wow. Oh, mission complete. Let's go do that first, actually. Uh, look at him. He's going. He's going with that big rock. That big hunk of pal palladium. I always want to call it palladium, which is an actual element, but... Upgrade. Next level, we get to build our second base. Oh, do I even want to take this apart? A sphere's factory and a cooler. Do I have technology points? I do not. I do not. Okay, so we're going to have to upgrade somehow. I need more stuff. And it's becoming dark again, so this is just going to be fun. Okay. It's getting scary dark, you guys. Still have so much work to do. Where is the ore? I thought there was ore up here. It's just stone. Whenever stone produces ore eventually. I think you have to like break down the... the oh, there we go. There's one. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. Let's go put the stone away. Oh, no. No. Okay, cool. Let us go put it away. I put stone in the other one, I thought. No, I don't have anywhere for stone. I've used it all up. Holy. Two more ingots to craft. And do you guys have any food? You have barely any food. Put in the baked berries and... Ah, uh, no, I'm going to keep the meat. You can take the mushrooms. I don't like mushrooms. They're gross. So we got 30 wood. I don't even know what I needed the wood for. I just need the ingots. Colidium fragments. Good, good, good. Excuse me. Only 10 more baked berries to go. That's not bad. Here we go. He's going to help me cook them. Even faster. We're halfway there. Good, good. Honestly, I'll let you finish it up. I got work to do with these ingots. So now we go to the high quality crafting workbench. Which one should I do? Axe or pickaxe? Wait, which? where did I put it? Where did I put it? Where did I put it? Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Where'd it go? All right, it's right here. There we go, we can now craft metal. So let's get the metal ax. Realistically, I should've done the pickaxe because that would've helped me mine ore faster. But whatever, we'll just go with an ax. Can I do the pickaxe too? Oh, look at that, I can, I can do both. So now we've got metal gear, the end of the first week we have started with a metal pickaxe and a metal axe and I will upgrade the armor too because I believe we might actually have enough just about enough leather so we just need to go destroy a few more pals thank you guys for watching and always remember stay random